Good morning guys and today we're gonna talk about AI <laughs> I I I you know we'll talk about AI but because you know I'm <clears throat> currently you know, checking out chat GPT4 and you know that that AI or that chat bot has been tested to pass like the bar exam and Ukuan and many people professionals from lawyers to even students in the states are using it to you know to write something write report essays maybe reaction papers and many more and it's crazy it's crazy good i mean <laughs> not saying crazy buang on chat gpt but more it's more of crazy good i mean Impressive, Sheva, that you would say if you're a student, you'd be mind blown. If you're a content creator, if you're a copywriter, you'll be shocked on what it can do. Grabe. Grabe, I would say, man, sometimes you um, you will be stunned on the the words that it can compose mo na ba na, na will ang akong question is will AI and uh, many jobs ba na one diba is it the the end of this is it the end of people na marabag uh, will it make us lazy na di na taganahan mo so what you know writing for me is as is one of the great skills in the age of internet because when people consume content they read about stuff diba? they read blog posts they read um, basically when you search in google you read and and if what about if it's just manufactured by AI ba? not based on someone's experience because mas maay mo suwat Ang AI will it really go and change? Diba? Money ko lang ana. That's the challenge of AI. A lot of people say it's a tool and uh, it's still human or whatever ko but sometimes what ka overlook na may mo na ma overlook ko sa high ba. Even in architecture ko the AI can make plans, can make blueprints for something. Diba ing ana siya ka impressive. Yeah, it's you know, evolving and it's bright. And man, I was wondering if you guys are using it. <laughs> and what's your opinion about it? Sometimes we just laugh at it as if um, at first novel idea, na, wow, amazing. But eventually, suddenly, it's taking over lives, it's taking over industries, it's taking over jobs. What's the option sa tao? Diba? Especially kaya mga ni college ba na so many people or college students are are taught na to um, what you call it na kaya to to write, de ba? To interact and then what if kaya ng chat GPT for example, it's not gonna be just about ng text chat. What if eventually it's voice chat already? Yung call center na. And it could take jobs at call center. <laughs> okay, interesting, very interesting. Okay, interesting yet. Yeah, and it's an interesting time. Now it's still in the infancy. Somehow, may pinakaibaw ana. But once makaibaw ni, once more students, let's say, use it. A question, and how would the teacher know that it's from an AI app ang imong your reports ang mga AI app she makes powerpoint presentations makes even drawings logos and <laughs> I don't know something anything under the sun sometimes there's an AI that will make who knows someday who make code who will code for you let's say give me make me an app like Google or something like that <laughs> it can happen and that's uh, 
while may nandang pa tayo na na human source ang lagi pa ng human element ang makikin ng human yes but it with AI maybe jobs before that needs like 10 people could just be done with with 5 or less way less so today nagkakwari kintahe ko um Sa AI, sa ChatGPT, how do AI affect blogging and copywriting? Let's wait for its answer. Artificial intelligence is rapidly transforming various aspects of modern society. Umuni yung answer, ha? <laughs> Masya ako. Uh, including the field of content creation. In recent years, AI has started to impact the world of blogging and copywriting. Imagine with several innovative tools and technologies being developed to assist content creators in their work. Here are some ways AI uh, is affecting blogging and copywriting. One, content generation. AI powered tools such as Chat GPT, GPT 3 create high quality content based on a given topic. siya. <laughs> Without human input, imagine without human input. With this technology, can help. So they can help the bloggers and copywriters save time and effort by generating content that can be edited and polished to meet specific requirements. Wow, bright, huh? Number two, content optimization. A tools can analyze data and provide insights on how to optimize content for search engines, social media, and other platforms. For instance, tools like Yoast CSEO can help bloggers optimize their posts for search engines by suggesting keywords, readability, and other elements. Three, personalization. AI-powered content personalization tools can analyze data about a user's behavior preferences and interests to create customized content tailored to their needs. So, yeah, why don't this approach and can help bloggers and copywriters increase engagement and conversations. Four, editing and proofreading. A powered tools such as Grammarly and Hemingway can analyze text for spelling grammar, grammar and punctuation errors, providing suggestions to improve readability and clarity imagine that and number five content creation AI powered content creation tools can sit through sift through a large amount of content to find relevant articles images and videos that bloggers and copywriters can use for their work in conclusion, AI is transforming the world of blogging by providing content creators crazy man, eh? and copywriting uh, content creators with innovative tools and technologies and improve efficiency, personalization, and quality. While AI tools cannot replace human creativity and expertise, they can assist content creators in producing high quality content that resonates with their audiences. Are you impressed? And GPT-4 <laughs> GPT-4 made it in less than 10 seconds. But pislit na ko, nag-start na siya so what? From introduction to conclusion and to think the topic is about AI and how it affects content blogging and content creation and copywriting imagine guys diba? of course you have to be good in queries but yes imagine if we say write me a report on blah 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 money facts I think it can make a report it can make news grab it it can change news writing. You don't know sometimes the news or the script that 
the newscaster, your favorite newscaster is reading, was made by AI. What a scriptwriter. Not a scriptwriter more, but more of an intern lang siya. Proofreading to check if may wrong facts. Because, of course, there's a chance that there are wrong facts. Butang one. But imagine, oh, with my query, it made sense. Na pwede na turuto na ko ikat and paste on a blog, on a page. Yed, dayon. So na on a blog, on a page, dayon. Say that the article was by me. And come to think it, did it? Didn't even, didn't even, didn't even well, lift a finger, making, I don't know, maybe you want to some words, some paragraphs, some if you want to add something, but <laughs> or when I, what if I read as, uh, what about, I use it as a speech, and I say how and log. Uh, talk and I would really sound credible without uh, by, and then wag na lang kung una-una ang answer the answer is not from me it's not from my expertise it's not from my experience even it's just from an from a chatbot <laughs> so diba huwag mo kay bawa na manang sometimes ang let's say states ang Canada maybe Europe are worried about that is imagine diba na marabag pahimuon mag essay ang mga students and you might be thinking they know how to write already because they write in perfect grammar they write na walay mga sayop but kung pasuwato na ni mo manually they'll be lost like are you lost little boy ano di mo na yes they bow or what if I'll use that chat GPT mahimu kong Love letters, one more ang uyab kag chicks, ang uyab kag lucky or whatever. When you wanna pursue someone, then you gonna use Chat GPT to write love letters, to know what to say. <laughs> it can happen, pero mas ni risk. Wakay ba kaniyong mga chat? Mausad, it's the same. Oh, di ba yung hibong mo? When you're together now, you don't, you don't know. Or but you, you'll sound awkward. Pero di ba? Pero kung mabasa ka sa kung kwaan, you might think I'm a genius. So man, I tip na ko. You wanna sound like a genius? Maybe check that out. Chat GPT. Or di ba ka lang AI? But mao na po yun. Don't make it. Well, don't make it rule your world. There, there are people who say that there is danger in AI. But there is. Right? You can say you can claim your work, that's your work. And say it is even work. And say no, it is, but it's from AI. Right? What if you become so dependent on it? Right? From your pleadings, from your lawyer, from your court. You're so dependent on it that in the end, no more, you become dull. And then what if offline? What if what I chat GPT? Diba? What if we make one? May nakikam himo ano sa chat GPT na even your closing statements, closing arguments are used by one. Are, is made <laughs> or are made by by AI. So, man ako ingo na there are dangers and that you shouldn't uh, that you shouldn't um, oh, I'm now looping I'm going to but diba na that di ni mo maliitin it should not um, underestimate no, diba I always underestimate ang dangers no, diba sometimes because believe na kay ka what if there's someone way better than you in using the AI and then uh, it could be used to beat you diba? so 
pa lang in the end <laughs> well AI is good kuya ko itag topic no AI is good you have to be careful you have one. and thank you so much for watching <laughs> and I hope we'll join this discussion about AI bye bye bye